welcome yet again to the Late Night Gamer and Cuba Libre. So uh, we just resolved the, the first propaganda card um, and I need to make one small correction. Directorio victory condition is actually actually at 2. I spotted it was at 1. But it should be at 2 because they have one population which they control and a base. So let's start with the first card of the propaganda and that is Escapade. So this is uh, Directorio goes first then government. Flip the next card and that's um, called Lara Zabal, which is coming up. Directorio goes first and they will take the event. The event card, the event here it says um, Yacht brings fighters. We can place a deer gorilla and base in either Kamagoi province or Orienta. I guess I could determine that randomly, but I think the best thing for the directorio is to place that in Orienta. So I'm doing that, I'm placing a base and a gorilla in Orienta. And they will get a base, so that's actually three victory points up. They are now what, five? Okay, government is next. Operations and special activity. So I'll do a sweep in Santiago de Cuba, in La Habana. Three cubes, four troops from Havana into La Habana. So that is going to cost me three resources because now the US alliance is reluctant. And three there, six resources. Oh, I'm going to six. I'm not sure that was a good idea, but I'll do it anyway. And I get to activate all of these as well. Then as my special activity, I'm going to do an airstrike. And I can destroy an exposed unit. One that is activated, I can do it in any one province or economic center. And I just take away one gorilla or base if there's a base uh, sitting there all alone. <clears throat> I cannot do an airstrike in the cities, but I can do an airstrike here. And I will airstrike this guy out of there. Now I should have four. No, I have control. Well, the government has control here in La Habana. And we are um, looking at. Lara Zabal. Now that we can see that the 26th of July will go first, followed by the syndicate. It says that I can place a 26th of July base where there is a 26th of July peace. Because the Venezuelan juntas are supplying arms. Okay, so I can place a 26th of July base, so the, the, the 26th of July. Yeah, I'm a player, that's right. So what will I do? I think there's a problem now there, but I can't do much. Can't hmm. And I can place a base wherever I have a gorilla. There's no room there. Here. And then the government do not have control anymore there. Okay, so the syndicate are doing special or uh, special activity or operation. And they rally, can I place a gorilla where there is casino but no gorilla? No, they cannot do that. Then they will move to. They will march an empty economic center. No, that's not empty, so they can't do that either. Then the question is, if there are the. Then the next question we haven't seen this before, is that the available plus closed casinos are greater than cash on the map. So the available casinos are six, and there are no cash markers on the map. So that is true. Then the government or then the syndicate will do a construct and they will do it in one space and two if they have more than 35 resources but they have 30 resources so they'll do it in one space they will do a construct the construct special ability says that they can do that in any cities that either the government or the syndicate control and it costs five resources and we have to place a closed casino or we can open a closed one there are no closed ones so we'll place a closed casino Okay, so they can't do it here anymore, but they can do it in Havana. And that is the only place there is space and where they can actually place a casino. So they'll do that. They will place a closed casino, so that does not count against their victory points. They have to open it first. It costs them five resources. So 
so they are down to 25 and now they will go special activity now the special activity is no surprise there it's profit that means they will place two cash markers first where syndicate has no cash then where no enemy then random yeah so they will actually do it randomly Let's see if they do that three green five yellow uh, that is actually in Pinar del Rio, which is right here. Second random province is a four green yellow six, and that is Oriente. And then after Oriente, they'll go to Havana. So that's the syndicate rounds finished. Okay, so we shift again the ineligible and eligible factions. Look at Eloy, and we see that of the two factions available, the Directorio would go first, but there is a blue circle there, so they will do something special. The next card is Defections. So we need to read it actually, and it says, so the Directorio will take this one. It's an inspiring Directorio leader, Oops. replace a non-Directorio, non-Casino piece within one space of Las Villas with two gorillas. Oh, that's interesting. So let's find out where that will be. That's, La Vil that's uh, Las Villas and within one space of Las Villas is either in Las Villas, in Camagüey or in Mantanas. Mantanzas. Matanzas. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, the special instruction read that says that um, Replace a government piece, if possible, an economic center lost. So they will not take this economic center, they will replace a government piece with two guerrillas here in Las Villas. Yeah. So the rule book says that they will remove police, then troops evenly. So they will take this police and two guerrillas are appearing here in Las Villas. That's the event. Sorry, that's the event. The government is again taking the special activity and I'm going to follow up now. So the 26th of July was actually quite wise in placing the base there. I think because if they placed it there, I will have a big scoop. So now I have to choose or do both. And I will do the special activity, which I will do now is assault. It's basically to eliminate enemy forces in any space. And the cost, which is three in this case, I remove one active guerrilla or base for each troops. Base is lost. But if it's a city or economic center, I can remove one piece for every cube. So police also help with assault in the cities. So there are no mountain spaces here. Um, but if there will then you have to count two troops for every everyone you you everyone you uh, remove. Okay, so here I have four troops, I can remove four pieces, so I'll move this guerrilla. And I'll remove the base. Bases go last. That's two. I will remove this gorilla as well. That's three. And I will close this casino. I cannot remove that, but I will close it. I will, and I take control there. And that cost me three resources. One, two, three. The question is if I should pay three resources to do the same in Santiago de Cuba. That's a good question. I don't know. Yeah, I mean, I get to take out five gorillas in one go with an assault there, so I do that. Seven, yeah. So I forgot to move that one down to seven when I took the base. Now I'll do my special activity. I'll actually do a mm, reprisal in any one government control space. And what I do is that I add a terror marker and I shift the opposition towards neutral. And I can chase one gorilla out of there. No. So if I did it in Las Villas, I could chase one of these guys out of Las Villas, but then this one would have to go down to neutral. Oops, one step towards neutral. So the only logical place I can do it is actually in Santiago de Cuba. And it's a free operation, it doesn't cost anything. I control the area, so I'll do that. Me to add a terror marker, which is bad, but the 26th of July will lose one victory point. Okay, down to six now. Seven, no, they have seven. Hmm, must have done some miscalculation. 
Government is completely broke now, so that's a problem. Uh, we shift here, we go up with defections, where we see that the syndicate will actually go first. And the defection says that um, there are some disillusioned fighters. So in a space already occupied by your piece and those of an enemy, replace two of the enemy guerrillas or cubes with your guerrillas or cubes. The next card. Well, that's interesting because that is an insurgent capability. That means that if this event is triggered, there's a permanent effect to the insurgent side. Oh, it's actually a truce between the Directorio and the 26th of July. Syndicate goes first on the defection card and they will take the event. So, is there a space that is occupied by my and an enemy piece? Yeah, there and there and there and there. Because if they were to do it in Pnadil Real, they will only remove one cube. The rule said they should remove as many cubes as they can, so I'm interpreting that to be. They can either do it in the Havana or in Havana. Uh, I will do it in randomly, just to terminate randomly. On a 1 to 3, it's going to be Havana. And it is going to be Havana indeed. And I will remove evenly police and troop. And add in two, two mobsters, two syndicates. And now it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And now the government has lost control in Havana and the syndicate has control in Havana. Right now it doesn't matter but um, so they took the event. I'm, I'm, I'm taking the operation and special activities. Yeah, I'm going to rally and I'm going to because the 26th of July can rally in any province without support. So that means that they can rally in here and I have quite a lot of cash or, or resources and I'm going to rally there, and I'm going to rally there, and I'm going to rally in Sierra Mastre as well. And I'm also going to rally in Santiago de Cuba. Okay, with rallying I place one guerrilla, or replace two with a base. So that is one resource there. I'll wait for this one. Two, three, and four resources. Here, where I have a base already, I can instead place guerrillas up to twice population plus twice bases. And twice population is two and twice bases is four, five, six guerrillas in Sierra Mastra. I have 13, that's three, that's five, eight. I will do an infiltrate. So, and that there's only one place I can do that, and that is here in Santiago de Cuba, that gives me another one in there. Did anything happen with the yeah, control? I will take control here in Mantanzas. Okay, so now the Pact of Caracas is the card. Next one is Ambassador Smith. Mm, so, yeah. And remember the Pact of Caracas, the Directorio will not take it. They will do an uh, operation with special activity instead. And what they will do, the flowchart asks, can they do a terror in an active space? No, there, there are no guerrillas in any active space, passive, neutral, passive. But they can assassinate at a government base. So the assassination is a special activity. And the accompanying operation is terror, so they will have to do a terror first. And they will do it in Las Villas. Um, and they will have to activate one of the guerrillas to do this terror. They add a terror marker. They shift this towards neutral. I'm lose, losing two support, or government is losing two support. Then the assassination says that the Directorio here outnumbers the police, there are no police present, which is... This is the importance of having police at your bases, because now they, they, um, they can do assassin assassination here. And they remove any one enemy piece from the space. In the cache they will remove an enemy piece. That's very easy what I'm going to do. You see this one is at zero, so I'm going to pass. And that will give me three resources back okay so these 
So the 26th of July and the syndicate are now eligible. Directorio is ineligible. I also come up here and is eligible and Ambassador Smith is coming up. Syndicate will go first, then the government. The event says, well, the shady one. Blindly backing dictator. I will shift US alliance one box up. Eight plus nine. Then I get a lesser of eight or plus nine to my resources. Oh, that's excellent. Phenomenal. That is really, really great. Next card is Carlos Prio. But okay. So the syndicate goes first. Syndicate faction sheet on the ambassador Smith says if government is a player, then do the ops and special activity instead. Okay, bastards. Then do that ops and special activity. So they will rally now because they can rally here. So that's what they'll do. They will pay one resource and do a one rally in Habana. They have one guerrilla left, so they will rally it in like that. And then again, they will do the profit here in La Havana. And they will place one here in Havana. Yeah. Okay. Next one is luckily, it's the government taking the event. US Alliance goes one box up. So that oh. means we're back on firm. We get plus nine to eight. That's excellent. And then I get the. Add lesser of plus nine and half eight. Well, the lesser is four and a half, and I round down to four, so I get four. That's seven. Okay, shift around here, and we are playing Carlos Prio, where we have the directorial force first. But first, let's see what's coming up. It's Brack. So Carlos Prio, uh, directorial are taking the event. And they will get plus five resources for that. They have no eight. It's there. Yeah. 26 of July are taking the special operations and activity. Okay, so I will do a terror operation. And I will do a terror operation in Oriente. <laughs> and just for the heck of it, I'm doing it in Santiago de Cuba. Ah, I'm doing it here as well. And I'm doing it also in Camagüey. That's hefty. Then I can do it. Yeah, that's nice. I do that. So one, two, three, four resources. And then I have only four left. But I get to place four terror markers. That's excellent. So there's a second terror marker now in Santiago de Cuba. I get back here to passive opposition. That brings me up to eight. I get to add a terror marker in Oriente. This one goes to active opposition. That's plus two. Oh, I need to flip my one of these gorillas. That's right. And this one has to flip. I'm flipping this guy. Adding a terror marker, go to passive opposition, that's another one. I'm flipping this one as well. Adding a terror marker, and going to active opposition, and gives me plus one. Yeah, excellent. Now the only special activity I can do is kidnap. Where terror operation and 26th of July exceeds police. Oh, there's no chance there. No, forget it. No kidnap possible. Then the shift will be playing Brack. Government goes first. CIA trains political police. Place one police anywhere. Add lesser of plus six or eight to government resources. That's excellent. Next card is US speaking tour. So I'm taking the event as the government, of course. I can place one police anywhere here. And then I add the lesser of aid. No, I add the lesser of plus six or eight. And that is six. Uh, so that is 13. 
So let's see now what the syndicate do. This is interesting. Should they rally? No, they have guerrillas at every casino. Well, could they march then to an empty economic center? They cannot. Are they, are they available plus closed casinos greater than cash on the map? Yeah, it is. So again, they'll construct. Man, they're constructing, they're building a new casino again. Okay, so the first they will place it where there already is a casino and the only place available then is La Habana. And then they will do a profit. Now there's something interesting here because, okay, so they have done a construct and then they will do a profit, but there's no available cash markers. Then there's a little loop here said, okay, then they will do muscle. And if there's, they count the muscle, well, then they will do bribe. So we'll go down on the special activity list as well. So if they can't do any bribe, and they can't, they will do no special activity. Let's say turn, shift. The US speaking tour. You can see that it's going to be the directorio that goes first on this. Expatriate invest. An insurgent faction adds a die roll in resources, and each other adds plus two. That must be each other insurgent factions. We flip this, and then we see there's another propaganda card coming up. Nice, okay, very exciting. So, um, Directorio is taking the event. They will add a die roll in resources. So let's see what they get. Oh, blimey, they got six. That's eight, nine, ten, that's 14. Oof. And every other faction adds two and two. The syndicate is also an insurgent faction. But the government do not get it. That's how I read the card anyway. It might be wrong. Give me your opinion. I can I can do a march. I will try to march now into one animal space. It costs one resources per destination. But if I march to an economic center, I don't have to pay. And that is exactly what I'm going to do. I can much with um, with active guerrillas as well. I'm not going to do that, or I am, but I'm marching into the economic center here with two. So it says, if destination has support or is economic center, and if moving guerrillas plus cubes exceeds three, then we need to activate guerrillas. Then I'm only going to march with one in there. And the special activity I'm going to do is infiltrate. Uh, and that's happening in a space without support, including an economic center, with or next to an underground guerrilla. Oh, under Remove or replace one cube with a 26 to deploy guerrillas. So that means I get two guerrillas in there. And I remove this cube. That's my infiltrate action. Okay, these are in eligible and these are eligible, but it doesn't matter too much because now it's propaganda. After propaganda, we are going to do this one, which is, and you see, um, this is an example of a government momentum card. So when this comes into play, it will be in play. This effect will be in play uh, until next propaganda card. So it's a, it's a best. It's the best possible time for a government momentum, and the government goes first on this card also. So uh, that is going to come into play if if the government wants. So we check for victory or any at, any faction at victory, and I'm excluding the human fac factions here. No faction is at victory condition. First, we take a look at the economic centers. And in any economic centers where guerrillas outnumber police, they will, they will sabotage. And that's happening right here. And that means that the government do not get this income. Instead, they will get 3, 6 income. And they will have a look at the 8, which is 9. So that's 15 income. This, that's 28. Then the 26 to reply, we get number of bases. Only 2. Okay. Directorial, number of spaces where they have pieces. That's 3. They have a lot of resources now, the directorial. A lot of resources. Syndicate, population of each city, an economic center of each unsabotage economic center where the syndicate guerrillas outnumber the police. Oh, 
man the, uh, because the syndicate now gets resources in the cities where they outnumber the police and they outnumber the police in Havana they will get six resources from Havana plus twice the number of open casinos and then they have three open casinos that's six so that's 12 resources now for the syndicate that's 30 resources now for the syndicate oh they are really on the roll here now mm. then you get to skim the government is in control here but there's no open casinos and the syndicate controls this one and the syndicate controls that one as well i should have placed the police there instead of in las villas it should be there because then i would be in control and i would skim ah hot diggy dog that's a mistake and then for the cash deposits now they will place bases or casinos but they cannot because they all the regions are full so instead they will take Six, oops, twelve, that's twenty-four resources for, for the syndicate. And I'm, I'm sorry, I'm not playing really well. <laughs> uh, I'm playing exceptionally bad, I'm sorry. Now the support phase, I have below 19, support, government has below 19 support. So again, this will deteriorate and I will lose all the aid again. Mm. So the question is now for the civic action. 26th of July, may spend resources now where they, they have control. And they have control here, but they're already at maximum. And they have control there, where they are at maximum. And that's about it. Yeah, they will do it. Directorio can now free rally in one space with neither active support nor active opposition. They can take away these two guerrillas and they can place a base in Camagüey and they will still retain control and they will go up on here so they'll do that. Now there's a redeployment so the government has to retreat from the areas where they have no bases or sit and that's not cities so that's basically here. You have to take all the pull the troops away and I'm by Six to him in Havana, so I can have control back. I'm dropping them in Pinar del Rio, I think. So that means I also take control there. Uh, so if there were any troops now in economic centers, I had to withdraw them as well. The police can stay in the economic centers. So I can move police. Mm -hmm. I need to have one police in Las Villas because these guys may do another terror operation there. Um, and I need to prevent that, so I need my police to outnumber the guerrillas. That's the troops and police redeployment phase. Now we get to reset everybody. Um, we take away the terror markers. The guerrillas go goes underground. Uh, and they open all the casinos. That's the worst thing. Six open casinos on the board. Take this out, so we know that you have played two. Two to go. Sanchez, Mosquera, and the next one is Pacto of Miami.